Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm back again once more with the reading. I'm going to be doing a reading for all Capricorns, Sun, Mirage, and Venus, Divine Masculine, Divine Feminist, Capricorn reading. Okay, this is for the collective Sun, Mirage, and Venus. It can be anywhere in your chart. If you're a Capricorn, this is for you. Um, and also, if the message resonates, please take it. If it does not, don't apply it. All right, I'm going to get right into the message and see what spirit wants you to know going forward. All right, this is, this is going to tell us uh, what it is that you need to know the most. Uh, uh, spirit wants, um, what spirit wants to give an advice for you. Um, and overall, um, it could be about your relationships, uh, romantic wise, um, career wise, um, personally, uh, and growth. Anything general and collective. All right, for the collective, right, Capricorns? Let's see what spirit wants you to know going forward. All right. All right. Thank you once more for coming back to my channel. Thank you for all your likes, shares, comments, subscribes. Thank you for your love and your loyalty. Thank you for your support once more. All right. Let's get into your message and see what source wants you to know, my collective Capricorns. Okay. All right. My spirit. What's going on for the collective? What do I need to know right now? What do you need to know the most? What's the messages they need to know right now? What's going on, Spirit? What do you need me to share with the collective? Give me clear, concise messages. Give me my collective truth and clarity for the life journey. Okay. Right out, we got the page of water. Oh, so I feel the energy of a new relationship or something, or excuse me, or somebody wants to come in and express themselves to you with, um, uh, with maybe an apology. Page of Water for me is somebody wants to show you their, um, they want to show you a side of them that's sensitive, Capricorns. So they want to show you a sensitive side to them. And they want to open up. It's, it's, they're opening up little by little, but they want to open up to you. And they're going to start showing you. Page of Water. And that's for the Capricorn. And Sun, the Rising Venus Collective. Divine Masculine, Divine Feminist. What do you need me to share with the Collective Spirit Guides? Ancestors Universe. What's the message they need to know right now? Please come towards them. What's the advice? What's going on in there? Personal, romantic life, career, finances, anything you need to tell them, please. Wow, wish fulfillment. Something um, that goes with this goes with uh, wish fulfillment for you that you've been wanting. This is something that you want to happen, something that you look forward to happening, or you could be doing this, or someone that you know is coming towards you with this Nine of Cups energy to give to you, all right? Nine of Water. You're going to be receiving wish fulfillment. You're receiving wish fulfillment. Yeah, something you've been waiting on. With three of fire, your ships are coming in. Um, yeah, something that you've been wanting to receive is not on its way. It's coming. Let's put a couple cards summarizing Venus. Thank you. A chariot, yeah, going forward. Something that you've been wanting to make happen is happening for you, Capricorns. Something that you've been wanting to make happen is happening. Chariot, moving successfully forward, right? What else, spirit? What else, for Capricorns? So I'm arising in this. What do they need to know? What's the message you need to share with my collective Capricorn Sun as an agreement? What's coming in for them? What's the message? What's the true intentions of the person or the environment that they're in around them? What's going on in their finances, love, career? Anything you need to share, spirit guides? What is the message they need to know? What's the message they need to be needs to be given? The world. A new cycle. A new beginning. Something starting over. The world it's closing out a cycle you could have closed out a cycle recently but yeah something's closing out so a new cycle can begin 
That's what I'm getting. A new cycle is about to begin for you, Capricorn. You're moving forward successfully, you're getting your wishes fulfilled. What you've been waiting on is coming towards you and for you. And you will be receiving a message, page of water, page of cups, a love offer, a, a, a friendly gesture, uh, someone being sincere to open up and show you their sensitive side. Um, something that you've been hoping for, waiting for, is now coming in for you. With the world, you will have a new cycle beginning. What else here, guys? Yeah, five of air. Somebody is willing to win at all costs here, power air. Somebody around you could also be playing some mind games here. All right, and you are you are aware of this, okay? With the five of swords here. So yeah, be looking out for that. Be aware of your surroundings. Understanding where where you're putting yourself in and um yourself into what you're putting yourself into, okay? With the five of swords here, some because somebody is willing to. Do whatever it takes at all costs to win. You can be dealing with a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, because the swords represent air. This is the air sign that you could be dealing with. Or, yeah, or you are um, really strategizing on how to win at all costs, or whatever this case may be. I feel the energy of someone playing mind games as well. Okay, so be on the lookout for that, which I feel like you already know and aware of. You are aware of it, okay? What a spirit. Yeah. It can be definitely from a king of uh, a, a air sign. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Gemini, Aquarius, Libra. Somebody that is around you or you could be standing in your power, being sharp, being uh, into, uh, being straightforward, bold, um, um, not afraid to speak up of what it is that you know and want. You're being very honest with yourself and honest around with others. I feel the energy of being, um, just being very truthful right now at this time. That's what you're focused on. King of Swords represent the truth. It represents swords of um, a very high intellect, very smart, very sharp. I feel here. You're very sharp at this time. Okay. Yeah, something about an air sign. It's still coming up in the air sign's energy. Three of air, something has um, ended or a breakup has happened or ending has happened. Um, Capricorn, I feel here. So uh, whatever it is, you're healing from it. With the three of air, you will heal from it. You get it um, clear. Of the, you're very clear on things and you, you're breaking things off that is not for you. Yeah. Okay, and somebody feels also like this is a missed opportunity for them because they want you. They want you, I hear somebody wants you. Let's see what else is going on. Let's get some questions, situations there. All right. Let's, let's see what's been working on. What's going on? Apple Farm, Sun, Horizon, and Venus. What is the message that I need to share with my collective sun, Horizon, and Venus, Capricorns, Divine Masculines, and Divine Feminines? Entrapment. Somebody's trying to entrap you, Capricorn, with pregnancy, money, and heartstrings. So somebody can be trying to put out the illusion of being pregnant or uh, pulling on your heartstrings, trying to make you feel sorry for them. I feel the energy of somebody wants you to feel sorry for them. But somebody also wants to entrap you, Capricorn. And there is silence, not actions, and crickets going on here, here now, right now, in this moment. So something could be crickets right now, silent, very quiet right now. Someone's not taking action, someone's silent. Nothing's going on right now. For someone because they're trying to entrap you and they they can be playing these mind games to entrap you Capricorn that's what I'm feeling I feel this energy of somebody trying to entrap you yeah if somebody's threatening embarrassing appearance somebody's embarrassed and threatening appearance here so somebody feels threatened by you Capricorn
and you have irreconcilable differences, divorce is final. Somebody's going through a divorce. You could be going through a divorce right now. And the it, it's saying that it's irreconcilable differences here. What well, divorce is final. So somebody will be getting a divorce and it's final. I don't know who that's for, okay? Take it how it resonates. <clears throat> Eleven eleven is on the clock. So wishes are being fulfilled. Wishes coming true. Eleven eleven. Make a wish. Woo. <laughs> okay. Interview, talk, conversation, get on the same page. Somebody wants to have an interview with you, get on the same page. So this is this could be a love interest that want to get on the same page with you. Um, Capricorns. All right. So it says, wanting to talk, conversation, and get on the same page. This is what somebody is wanting to happen, make happen with you, Capricorn. This is what's coming in for you. Okay, let's move forward. Okay, let's get something. Messages from What's the Tea deck. Okay, What's the Tea? Somebody creeping. <laughs> right out he came out somebody's creeping all right somebody's creeping around you you have a creeper capricorns be be aware, aware of stalker somebody's creeping uh-huh what else spirit guys what do they need to know what's the message they need to know and be aware of right now looking up Researching you, studying you, getting info. Somebody's looking you up, Capricorns, getting info on you. Researching, studying you, and getting info. That's what the card says. Uh huh. Somebody's looking you up. Like I said, somebody is stalking you. Somebody creeping. Hmm. But you on phase by. You're not worried about it. On the bottom of the deck, it says you're unfazed about this situation. You're not worrying about it. You know it's going to be all right. Okay, let's see what else. Let's see what else comes down for you. What's the tea? What's going on for the collective? Capricorn, Sun, Rise, and Venus. Divine Masculine, and Divine Feminine. What's the energy coming in for them, coming towards them? What do they need to know? Bad karma. Somebody is receiving bad karma. Somebody that's doing this is causing bad karma for themselves, or this is what's happening. Bad karma is happening for somebody. Mm -hmm. They put out things, expect not to come back. Oh boy, it's coming back. Dirty offer. Because of a dirty offer. That's why bad karma is here. So the card that comes out the next, out the next, is giving the story of what's happening around you, Capricorns. Always partying. See, somebody that's always partying that you know. Yeah. Somebody that's always partying. Who is this? Oh, we caught a case. Sexual infection. Sexual infection. Sexual.